What's going on, guys? Kai here at Golf Auto Direct in Waveland, Mississippi, bringing you the 2020 Dodge Charger in red with only about 70K miles. Guys, I just want to send you a quick walk around video of the vehicle, show you it is here on the lot. We're going to go into over the, some of the features and benefits. So, starting off, guys, like I always do, as you know, most vehicles in the used car market are only going to be one key. On this particular vehicle, I do only have one key, guys. People don't turn them in, we just don't have the capacity to make them, but let's hop right into it. So, we've got all four sensors here on the back of the vehicle. As you can see, this is the dual exhaust variant. On the key fob, we've got the lock the unlock, access to the trunk via the key fob, the remote start, and our panic button. If we're not using the remote, guys, the button is right here on the right-hand side, easy lift assist. Right down here, guys, you see no damage, no uh, moisture buildup in the water. We've got our battery and our spare tire right back here. Moving to the left, guys, you see we have a full 360 tint on this vehicle in the highest legal capacity. We have the all-black rim set directly from Dodge. Looking at these tires, guys, it looks like they've got some wear on them, but they've got really good tread still. Um, definitely roadworthy. No curb scratch on those rims. Really typical for vehicles that have that really small profile on their tire. Typically on SUVs, you don't see that because the distance between the rim and the tire is generally so much larger. But it's really nice to see that there are no curb scratches or anything here. Just a little bit of residue moving around the side no brakes whatsoever no cracks in the windshield guys beautiful beautiful car with the halogen bulbs and leds all black front um grill and then all red front bumper right down here guys you do have the halogen bulbs for your fog lights as well no cracks no damage no scratches no bumps or bruises down the left or the right hand side of the vehicle here we go guys here's a little bit of damage there just right on the paint from the front bumper and guys i spend every single day of two years with vehicles so to this degree is the things that i'm looking for stuff that's you know five or six of these scratches make up my pinky nail but we want you to be aware of everything so Moving forward, guys, again, we've got keyless entry on the vehicle. No major scratches, no brushes or anything like that. Hood of the vehicle looks really good as well. I can tell that maybe this is some kind of uh, wrap that they put on. Yeah, it looks like a wrap to me, but it's in really good shape. There's not a lot of discoloration or anything like that. Could use a good bath um, and maybe something to lay in. You can see that it started to peel a little bit on the top, but still looks really, really good. Here in the back seat, guys, you can see it's an all cloth, two tone interior, really nice braiding there in the seats. All the um, stitching is in good shape as well. No fraying, no issues with the door panels as well are leather wrapped. So guys, let's hop into the front seat. We'll confirm those miles and go from there. But for that, uh, guys, you can see we have automated doors and windows standard on every vehicle. We do have automated seats with lumbar support. Hopping into the vehicle, guys. This is a push start vehicle, starts right up with that dual exhaust. You can definitely hear that it's got a nice little gurgle. Other than that, here on the steering wheel, guys, we got our paddle shifters, our hand free talk to text, and our adaptive cruise control. As a 6'2 guy, I'm sitting a little lower in the seat than I like to. I like to be able to really get up over that steering wheel. There we go. This is a really nice spot as far as I'm concerned. Here in the uh, in the display, we do have a projection manager, so you can project your phone onto here. You can use your um, um, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and features like that that you're going to have in here in the in the vehicle. Um, right down here, leather wrap center console, guys. Nice deep well. We got a USB micro USB C. We've got a DC outlet and an aux port here. Right down here, we have a secondary 12 volt outlet. Nice little space for some change and maybe your keys here on the side. We have uh, track modes, traction controls, lots of different things and features we can uh, play on inside of here. And just to confirm those miles, guys, we're at 70,765. Vehicle drives and runs really great. Backup camera works, uh, no issues whatsoever. Uh, right now, let's see where we're at. So I don't believe we're in a sport mode or anything like that. Let's get this rid of this. So, no, we were in a default mode, clicking the button put me in sport. Um, so, even without it, the vehicle's extremely peppy, happy, great transmission, good brakes, um, good steering. 
doesn't feel like uh, it needs to any extra alignment or anything. Um, power steering feels really good. So um, I'm going to say a 10 out of 10 vehicle, guys. Uh, no abrasive smells, no discoloration. Every button works. No rips or tears, no eyesores or, or anything, uh, any blemishes that you'd really be like, oh, God, as long as I could get over that, I'd be fine. I mean, the seats don't even look sad in. Uh, shout out to our detail team. Uh, Chase Farr for doing such a fantastic job on all these vehicles. It looks brand new. And that's my rule of thumb, guys. You know, if you put two cars together, one being new and one being used, and you can't tell which is which, you're probably looking at the right vehicle. So, guys, again, this is Kai at Gulf Auto Direct in Wavell, Mississippi. Please let me know if you have any extra questions or if there's something I missed. Um, I hope you found value in my video, guys, and we look forward to hearing from you and earning your business. We hope you have a fantastic weekend, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.